Product cost from POP, get, this is all the commercial fishing boats that come in to unload the fish for the fish market, which is on the end of this pier at POP. At the very end is the auction block. Welcome to the POP Marine Expo 2023 at beautiful Honolulu Harbor in downtown Honolulu, right across from famous Nico's restaurant. And Nico's restaurant, that guy prominently featured on his uh, cooking show, is right across. And we got some cool shave ice tubs for the kitties. It also comes equipped with restroom facilities and the Harbor Police making sure that everybody is safe. Free buff or face masks with any purchases of $90, $99 or more. Free cap with any purchases of $199 or more. This is Pelagic and Yeti. Free gloves or tumbler with any purchases of $299 or more. Again, at booth number one, bring your receipt to the booth for show special gifts while supplies last. So make sure you bring your receipts. This is one of POP's uh, more popular exhibits from the Green Egg. And they're going to be barbecuing over here like they did um, in the past. There you go. Aloha. Hello. We just want to give you a quick moment to how the Big Green Egg got its name. Um, Ed Fisher was a um, he was a, a pilot for the Atlanta Pacific, and he would fly the uh, Kamado style cookers over from from that area, and he brought them back to the United States, and um, he found that the uh, people in the United States wanted to barbecue on them, and so we'd get them over 400 degrees, and they would start to crack. So he got together with the professor over at Georgia Tech and they came up with this formula they were actually looking for the formula for um, the space shuttle shields right and they were working with ceramics and they were fired at very high temperatures 2400 degrees for 12 consecutive hours and he actually got this recipe or this formula from it and it is a patented secret so that's the way that they came about with the ceramics for the big green egg super the way they found their name is so ed fisher was hanging around with a friend and he just picked green initially because he liked green he could have picked any color and they were just sitting around a dining room table talking and they were like, what should we call it? An avocado, a vessel, what should we call yeah. it? And his friend goes, it's big, shaped as an egg, and it's green. How about a big green egg? And that's literally where the name came from. Ah, fantastic. So what are your names? Um, speak loudly so I can pick it up. My name's Nicholas Boss. I live in California, and we distribute the Big Green Egg. My name's Dwayne Morris, and I am a business development manager for Big Green Egg for the Sacramento area. Super gentlemen. I appreciate that. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, it's nice to see the United States Coast Guard Auxiliary out. Thank you. This is their beautiful tent here at the POP show. POP is celebrating their 40th year. And uh, um, people from the United States Coast Guard Auxiliary are here spreading information and educating the public. You got a boat? We want you. That's good. I don't have a boat anymore. I had two, but uh, maybe soon. You had to mortgage your house. <laughs> Here we have the uh, Kuma display. Beautiful colors and beautiful reels here. They're showing off their show displays. Yeah, I've already sold a hundred reels out here. And we have uh, three service centers that can Right next to them are the pin display. Good morning. This is again, this is the 40th year anniversary for POP. 
Pacific Ocean producers here at Honolulu Harbor. Grand prize drawing as well. Big here green we egg the, package the around 245 yeah. this uh this afternoon. So you gotta be present to win the grand prize. That's happening around 245. Look at those beautiful glasses. Hey, thank you guys. This is the famous Lavaya brand of local shirts. And as you can see here, she's picking up the fish with ink. Transfer. You can see all the other fish they have here. Some of the shirts have the kids' ice cream. Make their stuff and cool off the left side. You can see right by the information booth. We're starting. Traditional senators, and then moving on to the international. But showcasing is uh, the new ugly sticks that uh, we have. Uh, yeah, those are good links. What about like, 10 and a half? So they range from uh, six all the way up to Oh, good size. Hey, you're going to have to break away from this and do some fishing while you're here. <laughs> okay. Alrighty. Well, it's good to see you again, sir. Alright, thank you. You oh, served me. All right. The Hawaii <laughs> Fisherman Alliance <laughs> for <laughs> Conservation <laughs> and <laughs> Tradition. We'll see you all to a Coast Guard Auxiliary at the number 25. We'll find great information and resources there. Sign ups for safety checks. And go Good morning. A lot of survey. As they move number 25, Coast Guard Auxiliary. Hey, hello, speakers. welcome. This is our POP 40th Anniversary Coming Expo. Lunchtime, I'm Neil, and this is our green stick and uh, merchandise display. We've been, we had right green stick demos over here for yeah, almost over delicious. 10 years, uh, maybe 15 years. We have, also, the, uh, uh, we have some new products on display over shop. here. Oh. Check out the hottest Richard, who is uh, fishing rods today. and boys, helping us out. And he has some new rods, uh, kayak series rod, boat rods that he made. Oh, is that the rods over here? Yeah. Uh, so new series just just being made. Uh, special. Four years in development. Four years wow. in development. Uh, um, awesome stuff. Awesome stuff. And um, so as you can see, we have our three types of green sticks on display. Uh, we haven't have the original Hawaiian, ancient Hawaiian green stick though. Oh yeah. Cool. Out on the water, I remember that from yeah. previous shows. Yeah, yeah, they used to uh, hang the bait over and they used to work it. You know how the green stick is, they yes. swing the bait up and down, same, same style. So, it's, uh, you know, the green stick te technique, it's been around in various forms for hundreds of years. So that splashing attracts the fish, obviously, right? Oh, yeah, yeah. All right, super. Hey, thank you. All right. This is famous Maui Gems polarized eyewear. Beautiful display of glasses, sunglasses there. We want to say mahalo to our sponsors, Fishing Rods of Hawaii. This is the Shimano Mizuho Brothers, Pelagic, Yeti. Mahalo to Nikos, Pen, Shimano, Sutomu, Shibite. This is DAR, Division of Aquatic Resources. They are uh, sharing information on conservation of uh, marine animal life in Hawaii, as well as fishes. You can also check out the old 
Okay, this is for Nita Fishing Innovations. Thank you, brother. Showing all the zip ties on how to live bridle your fish for trolling. And this is hard to get you right. Okay, just cut this off at the end right here. Now you, you see how this one has a, a ledge here? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You just put it underneath here like this. So you just you just prepping them for harder fish, you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And here he's giving us a live demonstration. Yeah. Maybe it's a harder needle, you know what I mean? Yeah. You just pop it right in. Oh, no. And you poke them through for the harder fish. And then wrench it through, pop that off. You can even use that needle. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You got that. Oh, he makes it look simple, doesn't it, gang? Yeah. <laughs> Easy. Anybody can do that. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Here we have the Yeti display. The authorized dealer for Yeti. All right, thank you, sir. Ahi and vegetable bowls. This is the Maritime Institute. So he runs it, and it's guys from all the islands. You have to go online, and it's for a full day, and it's legit. He's talking through everything. A lot of educational the displays at the POP booth. Certification. That's very interesting because they used. This to is the 40-year anniversary um, for POP. It's nice that it's not doing COVID times because that really was bad, wasn't it? Oh, you did? I, 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 that, here, like, this is the display from NOAA Fisheries, you like Pacific you Islands like? region. You dry bag? Phone, phone dry bag? Um, sharing educational conservation with the public today. Yeah, yeah. Feel free. That's it. Thank you. Number three. Number three. Mahi Mahi. Okay, this is Sun Dot Marine Flags. Maritime Institute, you learn more about the Maritime Institute. Yeah, Dan, yeah. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. And life there are so many people today, so many for the POP exhibit, that they have a line going around the block, and you have to get in to the, the back supply entrance, which I've never seen them use before. Here, right on the uh, canal side, we have the live demonstration and cakey casting cakey is for little kids so it's perfect you, you, you have nobody to hit accidentally with your lid because you got the water canal over here that uh, the boats and barges tie up to and right in the back a POP is United Fishing Agen uh, Agency otherwise known as the fishing block so the uh, local fishermen and the fishermen um, fishing the waters around Hawaii drop their fish off here and everything gets uh, processed and um, distributed to the uh, fish stores as well as restaurants. And that truck there for chopping fish, and I used to supply them direct at one time. These are the boats on the end of the pier with the fishing block behind me. Um, right across is Matson container loading docks over there. Now all the boats come over here, they drop off all the fish, and they go back out and get as much as they can. In the background is downtown Honolulu. And of course, being in Hawaii, you don't have to be in the North Shore to get your shave ice. Because it's going to be a hot day today. And we got the Kona shave ice wagon right here. 